During the winter months, whenever there's a large gathering of crows, there's inevitably a disgusting mess of excrement. This year, maintenance director Brian Parker says the crow problem in the city of Cortland has become especially bad. Every night, thousands of them roost on and around the Cortland County Courthouse. According to the expert out of Cornell, they are attracted to this area basically because it's well lit. This week, Cortland County rolled out its latest weapon in the anti-crow arsenal, two fogging machines which put out a mist of grapeseed oil. They were installed on the top of the courthouse by the binghamton base Ehrlich Pest Control Company. To humans, the grapeseed oil puts out a sweet fragrance, but to crows, it becomes an irritating nuisance once it gets on their feathers. It stimulates their preening activities so they clean themselves, it gets in their it gets in their nose and their mouth and supposedly it is uh, similar to hot pepper sauce for a human. The trees in the park are covered with crow droppings. This park bench defies description. The roof of the courthouse is so bad, the droppings have plugged up the drains causing $2,300 in water damage to interior ceilings. Parker says for the past two years, loudspeakers playing the calls of natural predators like owls and hawks, and even some shotgun blasts, would only work for a short time before the crows would return. Cortland County has tried just about everything to scare away the crows, including this owl decoy. Well, it worked for a while, but then the crows got so used to it, they actually pecked the head off of it. So now, Cortland County hopes grapeseed oil will do the trick. If not, the crows will probably hang around for another month or so, find someplace else to go when the warmer weather arrives, and then return next winter in perhaps even greater numbers. Jim Kenyon reporting.